Some helicopter pilots volunteered their time to find wayward animals in the storm. Our Don Denny went up with Blackstone Security. She joins us live. She's on the ground tonight from the Blue Horse Ranch in southeast Austin. Don. And Leslie, from the air, you could really see how bad the debris is, and that makes the search efforts that much tougher. Most of the horses that were lost during the floods, they simply got caught in the floating debris, and they just could not make it out. We could be finding horses in people's yards in these subdivisions over here. I mean, they could be, they could have made their way to high ground in, in backyards, literally. Kent Morrison and Blackstone Security helped in the search for missing horses washed away by Wednesday's floods. The chopper and their time is being donated. I actually thought I saw movement down there. Back on the ground, Elsa Decker waited, hoping for word. Four of her horses were already found. She's particularly worried about a horse named Rosie. I'm missing mine and alive or dead, I want to know where she is. While we were up in the helicopter, reports continued to pour in of horses being found. Some okay, some badly injured, and some... We unfortunately very quickly found three horses that were deceased, but it was just... I mean, the debris field that we could see from the air right off the bat, you could tell how fast it was running and how wide the path of water was. I mean, it was, it was really staggering. There may be close to 60 horses still out there missing, but we just got word that Elsa's horse, Rosie, was just found, and it sounds like she's okay. We just found her. You seem a little overwhelmed. I am. I thought we would find her, but I didn't think she'd be alive. So I'm very happy that she is. We have found several others who are not. And... Uh, so it's bittersweet. Very happy, but very sad, too. And most of the horses that were lost in the flood did not make it out alive. They were able to rescue 18 horses today. There are 12 still missing. Reporting from the Blue Horse Ranch, I'm Don Denny, KXAN News. Don, thanks.